Hey guys, welcome back. Time for your favorite, time for my favorite, bench training. Today we had two count pause bench. Um, with my Still getting used to my new setup. Uh, everything felt pretty nice and solid, nice and smooth at first. Um, really practiced on keeping my chest up, not letting it sag, keeping my ass on the bench, and squeezing the hell out of that bar. Uh, oops, you'll see that was 265 times blank. This is obviously triples. Um, working up to a nine RPE and you watch my right arm here. Uh, it, the le left arm is good for another rep, right arm, not so much maybe. So I decided to call it a day there. Drop down in 250, a uh, little bit of a low drop here, getting some a little bit heavier triples. I mean, obviously it's all relative, not heavy for some guys, but for me, bench being my weakest lift, this is uh, somewhat heavy, especially with the two count bench. It makes everything feel heavier since it has to set in your chest a little bit longer um, and, uh, I really working on my leg drive. Cause I sometimes with my new setup, I don't even use my leg drive. So I'm just focusing on staying tight. Um, kind of used to that. I went on to the half board press, which is basically, uh, the poverty half board press, which is the five pound plate, uh, banded to my chest with a mini band. Um, I do these with a light touch, just focusing on my, trying to explode off my chest. Um, and not relaxing. I don't, I hadn't done a lot of touch and go work, but I figured there's a place for it, um, especially if it allows me to move more weight uh, with the bench. So I decided to do that. And then there's nine with their 260. I'm gonna drop down to 245 for triples. These felt super light after the 260, especially doing touch and go. Um, it's harder for me to, to time my leg drive on the touch and go, but I'm getting used to it. Um, you can see there's a little bit of jump off my chest right as I lower it. So it's something I've been working on. Uh, obviously it's, you know, a work in progress, much like all of my lifts, but n none are more work in progress than the bench. Um, and here I finally hit nine. Uh, obviously it's a fast nine, but I was playing safe. And next you will see my top set of push press. This is 160 pounds with a strongman axle that my buddy left at the gym. It's a bitch to get in position and it's a bitch to press, um, especially when you have weak ass shoulders like me. And there we go. See you guys tomorrow for some uh, deadlift training.